Yes, us once again to GreekRecipes.tv. Dips and spreads are loved by pretty much everyone, and it's time to show you one of Greece's favorites, taro mosalata. Tarama, fish roe, which are fish eggs, are considered the poor man's caviar. It's an unusual dip that's soft and creamy and has a sharp taste to the tongue, and you're gonna love it. What I have here is five ounces of white tarama. At the store, you'll find two versions, red or white. I prefer using the white because it doesn't have any color additives. The white version comes from cod, gray mullet, or carp, and it's delicious. In our food processor, I'm gonna add the tarama, one fresh onion, and the juice from three lemons. Let's give it a quick pulse. Here I have 15 slices of bread that we need to cut the crusts off. My yaya, grandmother, and mom always use bread when they make tarama. Others use potatoes. There's no right or wrong to this recipe. Whatever you prefer is fine. I just prefer using the bread because it makes it lighter. Let's add the bread in the food processor. You can tear it up with your fingers a little bit. And while it's mixing, we're gonna add gradually a third of a cup of vegetable oil and two thirds of a cup of extra virgin olive oil. Last, we're gonna add a quarter cup of cold water and make sure it's cold because this is what helps tie all the ingredients together. And don't forget, add it gradually. Taramo Salata is traditionally eaten on Clean Monday, inaugurating Lent for Easter. So, here you have another good option if you're fasting. As you can see, our dip is creamy and soft. Quick tip, if you see that your mixture is thick and stiff, all you need to do is just add a little bit more extra virgin olive oil. On the reverse side, if it's too runny, just add a few more slices of bread. Cover it with plastic wrap and pop it in the refrigerator for six to eight hours before serving it. We wanna chill it really good. Tarama goes great with pita chips that you've baked in the oven, drizzled a little bit of olive oil and oregano, with veggies, and of course, with some homemade bread. It's delicious, creamy, and has the incredible aroma of the sea. You've gotta try it. It's really good, guys. Thanks for watching, and see you next time on GreekRecipes.tv. Yasu.